Okay, today I have a kind of fun video today. Um, I'm titling it, I didn't go to the National, but I got all this for $15 at the local card shop value box. So I had a little bit of time and some leftover dollars from my Steam up, and I decided to see if the card shop had the value boxes, and they did, and one person went through it and didn't buy much. Another person came by and said, oh, are those cards still in the corner? I left those there a number of days ago, and I said, no, they've been all mixed up. Everybody's been through this box a gazillion times. And so I still find all kinds of stuff, and a lot of stuff with some penny sleeves. But before I get to that, I got one postcard today, Pantone Cool Gray. That was from a set. You can see it's all beat up and scratched and tore up. And it came from Cool California. So I just thought that was kind of fun. So there's that one. So um, I cheated myself at I think $1.50 worth of cards, but I did well worth that, so I'm not really worried. Um, found this blue, the Ice Beast Returns Star Wars Mandalorian card. Not don't know anything about that card there, but just thought that was fun to grab. Some of these have prices that don't make sense at all, and I found lots of penny sleeves, so I just put them on cards I needed. Uh, here's a Kelly Earnhardt. Um, uh, here's a Robin Yount, uh, 82, I think. Tops. Found this Bob Gibson starting lineup, a baseball greats card here. Somebody marked it three bucks. Uh, this is Decision uh, 2020 or 21, I can't read the date there. Uh, 2020, uh, Ty Cobb Trump legal team. Kind of unusual card there, weird. Um, I found this black and white Edison Volquez from 17. Not sure what how hard those were to get. And I found a bunch of vintage uh, 73s that look like in relatively good condition. They might actually be upgrades or actually um, ones that I'm missing. Halonier, Nate Colbert. A lot of these were like the 300s, 400s numbers. Uh, Mike Voltanevich, uh, rookie card for 15. Here's a COVID-19 Donald J. Trump card. Weird. Uh, this one here is um, Thome, Toma Hamilton. I don't know, but it was autographed. So that's kind of weird. It's really hard to see. It was autographed. These were all 25 cents a piece. Al Albuquerque, gold, number to 2015. That's kind of a funny name, Al Albuquerque. Uh, we got Eddie, Mr. Fantastic Murray. Then I don't know what this is, but it's got Carl Yastrzemski in the sec, in the in the middle section there. And this one says it is baseball patches checklist from like 1977. No idea. That's probably like a test set. There were two more from this, but they were damaged by gum. Uh, Danny Ozark, um, 73. I thought this was from a set that I was working on, but I'm totally wrong. Travis Lee die cut of some kind. No, I do not need that for anything. Pretty sure I don't. Found a Jeff Burton I probably do not have, but for a quarter, I'm going to not, you know, go to eBay, and that's a dollar all day long. Clyde Wright, I needed that one. Roger Nelson, not sure, but it's an upgrade. Uh, Gary Reedus, but it's got the 65th anniversary logo in the corner there, so I'll put that with my 84 tops complete set. So that's neat. There's uh, um, some kind of uh, accolades, uh, Robin Yount. I got this uh, Eloy um, Holiday, I think, um, rookie cup card. So that's neat. Uh, Rayfield Wright. Uh, Eddie Watt was a good signer at one time. Not sure if he still is. Jerry Morales, 74. Mike Voltanevich Gold. Rookie card. Willie McCovey, 80. Kevin Kiermeyer, Future Stars. Some of those are set pickups because I don't have a lot of set, um, Series 1. Uh, Yusei Kikuchi, uh, Rookie card. This are really thick. Arismedi Alcantara. I don't know if that's the right Alcantara I should be collecting, but it's a neat thick card with a, I don't know, it feels like metal there almost. So, I don't know, foil. It's this really crazy card there. Couldn't find a penny sleeve to fit that. Here's a Britain Trump. <laughs> um, here's the virus. There was tons of those cards in there. Jeff Burton I may or may not have. Is that a red parallel, I believe? Red stripe there. This was um, a poster of Jim Nance from the 70s, early 70s, I believe. Uh, then we have uh, Biden's gaffes. What's not to like about Vermont? What a neat town. Then we've got an 83 Don Russ uh, Dennis Eckersley, an 83 Flair Dennis Eckersley, an Albert Almora Top Prospects, 
We have Bryden Gaffs, You're a Darned Liar. Um, we've got um, Jungle Cruise, um, The Rock, I'm sorry, no, no, that's not Jungle Cruise, The Rock, that's uh, Frank Thomas. Uh, then we have 50 Cent, that only costs 25 Cent. Uh, we have uh, Kerry Earnhardt to go with the uh, Kelly Earnhardt. Then we got this um, action-packed Kyle Petty. Tons of NASCAR in there, tons. Uh, hardly any Jeff Burton, so, but there was tons of a lot of the same players. Then we got Brandon Moss Gold. I just picked up any 15 golds. Uh, then we got Xander Bogarts with a slightly dinged corner. We have Jim McAndrew. Ken Brett, which I probably already have, but probably an upgrade. Fertando, Fernando Tatis Sr. number to 9,000. They had tons of these numbered cards, 2,500 and up, I think. Tons. Um, Ozzy Smith, 85. Um, Jody, Jody Heiss. Whoever that is, I'm not really sure. There's a little ding on it, but it was number five out of twenty, or five out of ten. Sorry, gold or uh, bronze foiled out of ten. Then we got Masahiro Tanaka, and last but not least, we got Macklemore and Jack White. So, um, like I said, I got about thirteen fifty in cards there, and I gave him fifteen, and it was well worth giving him the extra buck fifty or whatever it was. And I think that was a pretty good deal because a lot of these I know are dollar cards all day long. So really cool, cool deals finally from the LCS and hope you enjoyed that and um, that is my mini national and thank you for watching.